performers getting pelted with bones, and with jewelry, and even cremated remains. Adele is now threatening her audience! <laughs> with free $70 t-shirts shot out of a gun! Dang, you throw something in my Also with murder. Adele has a t-shirt gun? Did you not hear the murder part? Anyway. The threats went down at her Vegas residency. She's like in this beautiful black gown and she's just talking like a sailor. And it's amazing. I think that this is how people are like, it's like a show that's a kid at the moment because it's like on stage. Have you seen that? And she was like, this is like not going to happen. Oh, there's something about this I like. I like that Adele, she's a little hood. Yeah. Remember the first time when she started winning a bunch of Grammys and we all thought she was Adele. And then she gets on stage like, oh my God, I want a Grammy, can't believe it. We're yeah. like, who is this? Who are you and where have you been hiding that not sexy British accent? But back to Adele. This is clearly a change in her playbook that she's now talking about stuff all the time on stage. Yeah. And this is my theory, and maybe I'm wrong in this. Place your bets, place your bets. And the fact is, people talk about her when she talks about whatever. Does anyone know anything about that band the concert? There are a lot of people who play Vegas who are incredibly successful. They become really relevant in that city, but globally, they kind of become irrelevant because you don't hear of them anymore. You think the t-shirt cannon is keeping her globally relevant? <laughs> well, I'm not saying it's the best play. Now, threaten us out of here! Dang, you throw something in me.